sun the source of life on earth the sun the sun is the brightest object in the sky it is a huge ball of hot gases the sun is the closest star to earth although it is too far away from us no life is possible on earth without it the sun is the main source of energy for all living things in the world importance of sun in growth and photosynthesis in plant a seed needs sunlight to grow into a young plant photosynthesis photo means light and synthesis means combining together the green leaves of the plants combine carbon dioxide and water in the presence of the sunlight to make food this process is called photosynthesis the plant absorbs water from the soil through its roots it sends this to the stem and then to the leaves the water is taken to all parts of a leaf by the veins leaves absorb carbon dioxide from the air through the stomata the chlorophyll in the leaves traps the sunlight to get energy for preparing the food let us do an activity to show the role of sunlight activity 1 take a potted plant and put it away from the sunlight in a dark room for about 24 hours 2 cover a part of one leaf with strip of black paper and put the plant back in the sunlight for 5 to 6 hours 3 plug the leaf with black strip remove the strip of black paper and bleach it by boiling first in water and then in alcohol as shown in previous activity 4 wash the leaf in cold water 5 add a few drops of iodine you will see that the color of the leaf turns blue black except the part of the leaf which was covered with the black paper 6 it shows that the covered part of the leaf does not contain starch because it did not get the sunlight to prepare food this proves that the sunlight is necessary for a plant to make its food sun as a source of energy the sun is the main source of energy the energy obtained from the sun is called solar energy nowadays we use solar energy to do various kinds of work most of the calculators which have a solar strip are powered by solar cells these solar cells trap the solar energy and change it into other forms for our use a solar cooker traps the heat of the sunlight and cooks the food renewable and non renewable sources of energy the sources of energy like solar energy biomass and water are found in abundance in nature these energy sources can be used again and again and will not exhaust with time and are called renewable sources of energy the energy sources such as fossil fuels coal and petroleum which once used cannot be renewed and are called non renewable sources of energy fossil fuels are in a limited quantity in nature as they take millions of years to form naturally people should be encouraged to use renewable sources of energy in place of non renewable sources of energy conservation of energy we should keep these facts in mind to save energy 1 switch off fans lights and electrical gadgets when not required to save electricity 2 air conditioners geysers heaters etc 
should be used only when their use is absolutely essential. 3. Do not drive vehicles. If they are not required, you can use public transport. 4. Use solar cookers to save gas and solar heaters to save electricity. 5. Use pressure cooker for cooking food as it saves fuel energy. Know this. Light from the sun reaches earth in around 8 minutes. Know this. Enough sunlight reaches the earth's surface each minute to satisfy the world's energy demands for an entire year.